didn't expect it to be that emotional. When you look at all these history um, references on TV or in books, it's quite two-dimensional and it's quite detached from real life. It's like, oh, isn't that sad? Next. Um, which is, you know, an unfortunate way of seeing things, but it's the way it is. And then when you go and, and experience this where you're in it, mm -hmm. uh, you can't help but feel a kind of a, an emotional human connection to the people that are there. Like you can see them crying, you can see the emotion in their faces. Um, it's very visceral. Yeah, um, you're, you're so in it. Like it's the closest we'll get to time travel and the fact that like something that was a 2D image um, potentially like was black and white and then you're experiencing it 3D in full colour, like life size as well. You know, like, you look at a photograph and you know, in a way you are getting um, a window into the past but they the people in it might be like this big and then suddenly they are the same size as you um, and you're like face to face, eye to eye with them, um, seeing what they were doing. Mm -hmm.